So I want to call upon another dedicated woman to come up and give us the introduction on the four pillars framework. This is no other than Madame Ilunga, our standards coordinator. A hands of applause as she's coming on stage. Good afternoon, everyone. It is good to be here. It's good to have you here. Um, it is a dream come true uh, for this association to reach this level. You know, we started way back in uh, 2020 when we started talking about uh, standards and quality and how we can improve the, the plumbing sector itself. So for us to be here, um, it's actually a dream come true. And I thank everyone that has been involved, especially the, the companies that have come on board to sponsor us to ensure that uh, Paza becomes in Zambia. So meaning that uh, plumbers will no longer be a, a, or plumbing will no longer be a career that, will, that is overlooked because they were not really recognized even in the party. But with the coming up of Plumbers Association of Zambia, it will be another level for, for plumbers. So what are we talking about? I'm here to talk about uh, the standards and qualities that have been introduced in the, um, in the whole structure of uh, Plumbers Association of Zambia. Um, like uh, the president here mentioned, there's a law that has been put in place and there's uh, what we are also calling the, the National uh, Standard uh, Plumbing Court that is uh, underway, which will ensure that uh, quality and standards are implemented here in Zambia. So um, why is that important? You see, uh, everything that we are, we are doing, the customer must be satisfied, and how are they going to be satisfied? It is when we introduce uh, standards and quality in whatever we are doing. So meaning even our practices as plumbers should have uh, standards and quality in them, and that's what the plumbing code is actually uh, coming with. So it will be a mandatory thing for all plumbers, so that we are all standardized and we all work with uh, quality um, uh, conditions or our skills are accompanied with the quality as we are working. So we are going to just uh, talk about uh, briefly the four pillars framework of plumbing industry which is participation, practices, products and uh, protection. So participation is uh, looks at the, the, the training requirements. So what are we saying? Apart from the plumbing training that we have received, we also Note that it is important for uh, plumbers to go to other trainings, for example, trainings under quality, so that we are able to standardize all our works, meaning that the, the, the standard of work that is delivered in Northern Province should be the same as the standard of work delivered in Southern Province. It doesn't have a matter if it's a female plumber or a male plumber or from whichever school they graduated from or trained from, we have to have the same standard. The other thing we talk about, apart from uh, the, the, the skill delivery itself, is the product that we have in Zambia. These who are selling the plumbing products should also have quality product being sold out there. Meaning that we need to have a standard that will be able to guide everyone that is actually operating uh, in the plumbing industry. So this plumbing product, it is an, uh, under, well, maybe by next year, it will be an answer, which will be a plus for Plumbers Association of Zambia. We will be able to go out there and even monitor or inspect what is going on, what kind of products are being sold out there, what kind of products are coming into the country, are they according to the specifications that are stipulated in the standard report, you see. So we should make uh, Plumbers Association of Zambia uh, an association with meaning Okay, I'm sure many, you know, we have been wondering, what is this plumber's association of Zambia for? How are we going to benefit? For example, if you are a plumber registered under plumber's association of Zambia, you will be considered more than a plumber 
who is not registered under private. Why? Because for you, you will even have a plus of the, of the training of quality training, like we're saying, and certifications, meaning that you'll be higher than a, a plumber that is not uh, registered under the Plumbers Association of Zambia. And already we are having um, requests coming to say we need plumbers registered under PASA. So meaning even before the SI is out, we are already making a name. People are already appreciating the standard and quality uh, code that is uh, underway. So with this, um, the, 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 the four pillars framework of plumbing industry, we will be able to ensure that the plumbing industry comes to the level of, it's recognized like other, other careers. You know, where we, we talk of uh, the Engineering Institute of Zambia, you see, that is how even PASA will become. The way you, the, the, the engineers are recognized, that is how even plumbers will be recognized everywhere. You see, so quality and standard is something that we have introduced and we will go about a countrywide campaign to ensure that this four uh, pillars framework of plumbing industry are understood and all plumbers come on board or, uh, or uh, members of or Plumbers Association of Zambia. Okay. So I hope we'll be able to appreciate as we uh, begin this journey. So with this um, program that we have today, I am very happy to be here. And um, I'm just encouraging everyone, especially the president, he has been so, you know, energetic and so positive about it. And I'm encouraging him very much to actually continue. Please continue breathing in. Don't die in the middle. Oh, yeah, so, thank you.